this tutorial is all about using guidelines. Okay. Uh, okay. I have a poster here that I've done and uh, try to zoom in here. Let's just make this not line up. Let's group that. Okay. Now here's my problem. I'm I want to use the guidelines so that all of these texts will line up. So what I'm going to do is we click on this part of the uh, ruler. You click and then you drag and you'll see that there's like a broken or a dash line. Okay? So you click it but you don't release. Then when you're happy with the position, then you release. So that's how you you you, you add <coughs> guideline. So let's do it again. So click and drag. Click and drag, but don't release. Then when you're happy with the position, then you release. You can also do that <coughs> horizontally by click on the rulers and then do it this way. Okay. Now the question is, how would I delete a guideline so it's really easy you click on the guideline and it becomes red and just delete click on the delete button and that's it now sometimes you've got lots of guidelines and say for example you want to see the whole poster without the guidelines so that you won't be distracted it's also easy you just go to view and see guidelines is smart is checked just click there and you don't have any guidelines let's go back to the guideline I'll just put the guidelines here so now in here then I can move this over there now I know that's lined up and this one's lined up too okay so just in case your rulers are not visible okay so you have to click on view rulers okay so if you wanna <coughs> create uh, guidelines you have to make the rulers visible first then you can do guidelines so click here in the center of the ruler and then drag if you want to uh, have a vertical guideline click here and then drag and that's how we do it now there's another mm, trick here too so that all the objects would snap to a guideline so you click on view snap to guideline so what happens when you click on snap to guidelines okay so for example here you click this object and then you move over to to the guideline now you'll see that it snaps to the guideline so you know that the guidelines i mean the object will be exactly to the guidelines because it snaps to the guideline and uh, I think that's it for the guidelines.